Hey YouTube, um, I'm doing a bit of a different video today. I am actually going to start a challenge in three weeks or, you know, basically within the next three weeks or, or so. I will be challenging myself to audition for a Juilliard Masterclass in the piano. Now some of you might not know this, but I was classically trained. I took piano lessons and everything, you know, very brick and mortar kind of method from the ages of about five to almost 17. Um, I'm 25 now, so it's been, you know, a very long time since I've professionally taken any lessons. I have actually continued on with my interest in the piano, even when I became a, you know, actual adult. And, you know, I have played from time to time. I actually try to play at least once a week. Um, I think it helps me get to kind of like retain some of that muscle memory and not just kind of like lose everything. You know, but that being said, when I was a kid, I was not interested at all in sitting down in front of a piano, like this inanimate object, just randomly like plonk keys for like hours on end with like no end in sight. And I remember taking piano was always so difficult because like it's really hard for anyone to sit down for like, you know, an hour to begin with, let alone a little child. In any case, um, what I'm trying to say is I really should have taken my training more seriously so it can prepare me for like, you know, opportunities like the one I'm about to embark on. Um, so what I'm going to do now is the audition requirements require two um, criteria. So there's like the musical theory part, there's the sight reading, sorry, three criteria. So there's also obviously the performance. They want me to perform two contrasting pieces. Now I was actually taking my ATCL exam, which is the associate for the Trinity College of London. Um, so their musical program, their diploma kind of program required me to take this exam that I unfortunately failed. In my defense, the pass rate was 30%, but you know, I also definitely could have practiced way harder. Um, so that's the level which I'm at for my piano skills. Um, I've, pr I've you know learned for a bit over a decade. I'm nowhere I don't think I'm anywhere near good. I just think that I have enough training that at least it's like somewhat passable. So we'll see how it, you know, ends up being in another three weeks or so. Anyway, so there are four choices for the pieces I'm gonna play. Um, I chose these four because they're the ones I'm most comfortable with. As of now, the most comfortable with and the piece that I actually believe is my best so far is a WC Prelude. It's, um, I believe the number five in book two. Now the problem is I have to pick two pieces total. I have one picked. So the other three pieces are one of Chopin's um, Nocturnes, a Bach piece from his Well-Tempered Clavier. Um, it's a very well-known kind of work. And lastly, there is also a um, Brahms piece, the Intermezzo Opus 118 number two. Of the three of those, I would say the one I'm most comfortable with is the Chopin Nocturne. I think that speaks to me a lot on an emotional and personal level. I think that that's the one I could do the most lyrical kind of performance you know, of. But that being said, the Bach piece will showcase the most kind of like technical ability I have. And it is obviously by that you know kind of definition, the hardest piece for me to play. I actually went on Reddit and I read a lot of other you know, websites, I talked to a bunch of my friends who are music students and music teachers and, you know, as such, and they all recommended me to play the Bach piece. So I will be attempting to do that. So what I'm going to do is I will play each of the pieces today. So this is going to be a very long video um, and then see where I'm at at the end of the video. And I'm going to try to like post at least once or twice per week just to kind of update everyone on my progress. Um, Again, I'm on a very kind of restrained kind of time constraint here. Um, of course, if I hadn't known about the opportunity earlier, which is no fault of the school or anything, like I actually didn't even know about this until two days ago when I looked it up online. Um, but yeah, so it's gonna be a really tight, you know, time crunch, but I'm hoping that we'll do well-ish. Anyway, um, let's actually listen to the pieces. 